Meanwhile, city and state road crews have made a lot of progress clearing roads in the Huntsville area and throughout Madison County. Yeah, a lot of streets are now clear and the major roads are looking pretty good after days of being covered in ice. News 19's Emily Moser joins us now live from the Research Park area with the latest on the conditions there. Emily. Good evening, guys. That's right. I'm out here in Research Park off of Explorer Boulevard. Now, I picked this location because it's kind of easy to show you the best of both conditions. Here behind me, you can see the main road, Explorer Boulevard, is pretty clear, but even just in the median in the side streets, there's still a lot of slush, a lot of ice. Now, the city of Huntsville tells me they were prepared for a snow event, but not quite an ice event. Ice is something that there's no plan that will will fix ice. You have to uh, work at it every day. The city of Huntsville is finally starting to thaw after days of being covered in ice. Roads are seeing a lot of improvement thanks to work crews and snow plows. They're going throughout the city, getting the major minor collectors, trying to get those bladed off, get the ice in the a little bit of snow, there is mainly ice. Huntsville's Public Works Director Chris McNeese says they need people to be patient as they work to get to the smaller streets. Stay inside, stay warm for now until we can do our best to get most of the roadways over. While a lot of streets are looking more clear, emergency management officials warn you to not let your guard down. We're not we're not out of the woods yet. Temperatures tonight to dip down well below freezing and then tomorrow, uh, Saturday, to be in the teens and not rise any higher than, than the mid-20s. So we've got another stretch of really cold weather. With more cold temperatures on the way, any water or slush on the roads could refreeze overnight, once again causing travel impacts. Both Huntsville Police and Huntsville Fire and Rescue have had a busy week assisting on crashes and even falls. Fire Chief Mac McFarland says even if you aren't driving, to be careful when on ice. It's really slick out there. So if you don't have to be, if you have to be out, be just super careful and be really cautious of the ice and stuff. It's not, it's not just slushy snow right now. We're doing ice. So be careful and try to avoid the falls. We cannot stress it enough. Black ice will be a big concern tonight and into tomorrow. So just be careful and take it easy if you are going outside. Live in Huntsville tonight, Emily Mosner, News 19.